hello guys welcome to boxing block center and please if you're new to this channel make sure you click the like and of course the subscribe button right now and also go to the notification bell icon click it and sell it all not about opinion you bang a new associate you will definitely be notified well it looks like testing fury is not handling this first ever defeat well it's not uh, you know handling it properly because um it was recently spotted at a bar in his hometown Moka Mo Morkambi or something I think Morkambi is, is called well Fury drunk fell on the on the floor you know at the pavement Fury is not handling it handling the loss well and uh, hopefully he doesn't go back to you know the old fury after the Klitschko you know victory in this case it's, it's more difficult because I feel like the reason why fury is like this because he thinks to himself and say why how I did everything good I trained well I hate well I you know I buy to all the routines, you know, I boxed well, but still couldn't be the midget, like Usyk. I think that has gotten to him. Fury has lost the plot, or he's losing the plot. I think if Team Usyk are seeing this right now, Usyk is a very professional guy, he doesn't care anyways, he wouldn't really bother himself with that because Usyk will come in shape regardless and one thing about Usyk he doesn't underestimate any of his opposition he comes in shape he comes prepared he comes with game plan and he comes to win Fury right now is going back to what he used to be when Wada found him remember Wada is one of the reasons Fury Got back into boxing. Wilder, according to Wilder, he brought Fury back. Yeah, he, uh, he brought Fury back when Fury, Fury gave up and wanted to basically end his life. That was what Wilder said. I think that was at the yeah third press conference, the one for the the trilogy bout. When of course Fury was on a high you know after beating Wilder for the second time I mean the first time you know stopping him and then Fury was very confident going into the trilogy that he was going to stop Wilder which he did but Wilder then reminded Fury that he is the one that brought Fury back that he made it possible Wilder and Fury colluded together to Firzat and Joshua but well unfortunately as you can see it didn't work out not like that and that's the most important thing Joshua managed to break the wall down Joshua wall was erupted you know to make sure Joshua didn't cross the wall or Joshua did bro I would say you guys should pray for Fury because the way things are going right now for this guy right here he could have end up very bad you know so it's funny Fury cannot handle defeat. And the worst thing about, about this loss is that Fury knows he did everything the last time to beat Uzi, but still couldn't beat him. So now he's thinking to himself, what else can I do? You know? The Usyk loss made Fury think twice and probably giving up 
So it's one of those things you just see and um, yeah, realize that yeah. I mean, at least Joshua handled his loss well. Joshua was got it for sure, but he handled the loss like a champ. Fury has a chance to beat um, Lucy. I think that will be very difficult. Not impossible, but difficult. Especially knowing the fact that Fury knows Usyk is not is not based by anything at all. Not by his mind game, his tricks, nothing at all. Usyk is on business. He stands on business. And that's what makes Usyk dangerous. And that's the reason why Usyk is on top. But Comment below, guys. A lot of you to subscribe. Fury for Tyson Fury. That guy is not handling the lost well to Uzi. It's crazy, man. It's the way. Publish your. Cheers.